video is a short tutorial involving a new design of Folio Tech presentation. We are going to do an overview of the key components of this particular system, beginning with what we reference as the top black bar or the TBB. It's very icon heavy. Let's walk through each of these icons. The first of which is the dashboard, which is the screen you're currently on, giving you access to all of the functions within Folio Tech Presentation. The second is for your identity page, which we'll have more information on in the future. The third allows you to manage your e-portfolios. The fourth allows you to manage the communities you are affiliated with. If you are a community moderator, you will also have access to this icon, which allows you to manage the communities you moderate, followed by your files repository, where you can manage, obviously, the files you've added into the system. To the far right, you can chat with one of Folio Tech support reps or access Folio Tech's help system by clicking that icon. In the drop-down menu, you can manage your account settings, look at the feedback you have received, or log out of the system. We're also going to take a look at each of these components quickly. So the first is the identity page. That's a screenshot of your identity page, so you can always know what that looks like. This allows you to edit your identity page, and the link shows you the public view of your identity page. If you are a moderator of communities, this area appears to the top right. If you are not, that does not show up. This icon always takes you to a management screen for that area and the plus usually indicates the ability to create or add. Three, the number here indicates how many communities you moderate. Same is true down here with ePortfolios. The three indicates the number of ePortfolios you've built. This icon allows you to manage it. This icon allows you to create new ePortfolios. And this also takes you to the management screen for ePortfolios. Just below that, we show communities area. So you can join a community by clicking the plus sign if you are not already joined to one. You can also manage the communities you are affiliated with as well as see that you are affiliated with four different communities. Let's go back to the TBB, the top black bar, and quickly walk through each of these pages. The first is managing your identity. This gives you access to your identity page and the ability to edit how this looks and manage the content of your identity page. The next icon, as I mentioned before, is ePortfolio Management. Clicking that icon takes you to the management screen listing all of the ePortfolios you've created and the details surrounding each, as well as giving you the ability to create another ePortfolio. Communities shows you all of the communities you are a participant in. And there are some functions also available on this screen, which we'll be talking about later. This shows me that I am a participant of one community and a moderator of an additional three. If you moderate, you are also a participant. If you are a moderator, you do have access to that icon, which allows you to choose from the communities that you moderate and then click one of those communities to manage content inside of it, the users inside of it, um, view the portfolios, and other information about those users. Finally, the files link allows you to manage your files repository where you can view images, create folders, organize documents into folders and the like. And of course, once again, the two help components. Back to the dashboard, this completes this overview of Folio Tech presentation.